It's 4th of July. Happy 4th of July, everybody. Independence, not his birthday. So today, I am making a mad Make America Drink Again cocktail. So we all need to drink in this society. This politics in this world has all made us drink. And so why not have a good 4th of July cocktail? So let's get started. So for this drink, we're gonna need a big old glass because it's gonna be an ice slushy drink. It's super easy. I want everyone to make it. Now, before I get started, I've made a lot of videos. If you've tried my videos, I want first, if you like to try the videos, I want you to do the thumbs up, the like. If you love to do like, if you tried it and you loved it, I want you to send me a heart on my video below. And if you have any comments, leave a comment below if you have any questions on what to do next with the drink or if the drink didn't turn out right. Let me know. I want to hear from you because the next drink might come from your ideas. I love hearing from all of you. So before I get started on these cocktails, I want to show you my gloves. I made these gloves and I'm also selling them on Etsy. They're called Queen on the Go gloves because who's a queen that has to go? So you just throw these gloves on. They take a couple of minutes to put them on nice and slow so they don't rip. And it's a beautiful little thing because who has time to use glue and press on nails? It's so fun, fabulous. So you should try it out. So what we're gonna do is get our little glass. So with the colors of our Independence Day cocktail, we're gonna use red, white, and blue. We're gonna start off with red and Squish up the, today we're using Daly's Cherry Limeade Frozen Cocktail. I love this cocktail, it's easy, it has alcohol in it, but not a lot. So if you're one of those weak drinkers that can't handle really the alcohol, this is perfect. But if you like it extra strong, you can add an extra shot in it, and I'll show you guys in a minute. So first you start off with the cocktail mix. And that will do, just a little, because you want to build layers in this cocktail. For more color and a layer, you also want to add raspberries or strawberries. For this, I'm using raspberries. Mama is so thirsty. It's so hot outside, I've been working, and I just want a nice stiff one. So after that, we're gonna start off with white and make sure you punch it up it's the pina colada frozen cocktail Ooh, it almost popped out at me you do white maybe a little bit more so when you freeze it you take it out for about 15 minutes so it could thaw out make sure it's not completely thawed then you add blueberries or blackberries. Now it's time for the blue layer. The blue, we're using Hawaiian blue, frozen cocktail. Again, warm it up with your nice hands. Get the nice slushy all loosen up because it's hard. It's real hard right now. But make sure it doesn't pop out in your face. Not a facial you want. Go nice and slow. Ooh, it doesn't want to come out. Sometimes you gotta open it up a little harder. Ooh. Like so. 
And there you have it. You have your red, white, blue layers. If you want a little bit more red, I suggest getting some Gatorade, the fruit punch kind. And there you have it. Patriotic red, white, and blue cocktail courtesy from yours truly, Drinks With Destiny style. And now I have a special, special announcement. If you want this cocktail, you have to get it extra boozy, get your little mini platinum, and just douse it all in there. Now this cocktail is super, super sweet. So if you don't like sweet drinks, I don't recommend making this. But if you do, which most of you like sweet, you can just add a little bit more vodka and there you go. Let's try it. Now, when you do go like this, because you do have to mix it up, it might, all colors will join together, but it still looks so 4th of July. Ah, uh, it's refreshing. I love it. I taste the pina colada. I taste the blue Hawaiian. And I taste the cherry limeade frozen cocktail. This is such a treat for 4th of July. I also want to announce that I am running for president in 2020. I decided I'm going to run drag queen in heels running for president. You're getting an abortion, you're getting an abortion, everyone gets abortions. Everyone gets raises, everyone gets $17 an hour. Well, if you're having more than that, then you're getting double that. But if you're working at McDonald's, uh, Burger King, Taco Bell, everyone gets $17 an hour. So, who's gonna vote for me? You're drinking diva of Detroit. I am gonna run. And no one in the White House was hurt during the making of this film. I have to let you know. So I don't want no one coming after me. Russia. Mm. All right, y'all. I That does it for me. I am done. And of course, always drink safely. If you're out there watching 4th of July, don't let go of those fireworks. Don't touch it because if, I don't want it to pop in your hand. You won't be able to make drinks. So. Always drink responsibly, always play safely, and always have a good, strong cocktail. Oh, I'm not really running for president, but I thought that would be a fun thought.